Understanding, being close-minded. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to our channel. Today, we're diving into a fascinating topic that's crucial for both personal growth and effective communication, being close-minded. Understanding this phrase will not only help you in English language learning but also in navigating social interactions more smoothly. So, let's get started and explore what it means to be close-minded, why it matters, and how we can open our minds to new possibilities. Being close-minded refers to a state of mind where a person is not open to new ideas, opinions, or arguments. It's when someone has already made up their mind about an issue and refuses to consider different perspectives or change their opinion, regardless of new evidence or arguments presented. This attitude can limit personal growth and understanding, as it blocks out the possibility of learning from others' experiences and viewpoints. To better understand the concept, let's look at some common examples. Refusing to listen to someone else's argument because it contradicts your own beliefs. Dismissing new ideas without giving them a fair consideration. Judging others based on stereotypes or preconceived notions. These behaviors show a reluctance to engage with anything that challenges one's current beliefs or comfort zone. Being close-minded can have significant negative impacts on both personal relationships and professional environments. It can lead to misunderstandings and conflicts, as communication is hindered. It limits learning and growth opportunities, as new information and perspectives are consistently ignored. It can create an unwelcoming or hostile environment, especially if close-mindedness is directed towards people with different backgrounds or beliefs. Becoming more open-minded is not always easy, but it's incredibly rewarding. Here are some tips to start the journey. Listen actively to others, even if you disagree with them. Consider new ideas and try to see things from different perspectives. Ask questions and be curious about why people think the way they do. Be willing to change your opinion when presented with new evidence or compelling arguments. Being close-minded can hold us back in numerous ways, from stifling our personal growth to hindering our relationships with others. By understanding what it means and recognizing its impact, we can take steps towards becoming more open-minded, enriching our lives and the lives of those around us. Remember, the world is full of diverse perspectives and ideas. Embracing them can lead to a more fulfilling and understanding life. Thank you for watching, and we hope this video has been helpful. Stay curious and open-minded, and we'll see you in the next video.